Hi there, I'm Alison Karak, owner of Stitch Real Estate Transaction Coordination Company, and in today's video, I am sharing what I think is the worst mistake that ICTCs make in their customer service with their clients. The number one thing that leads to unhappy clients. And the worst thing you can do as a TC, in my opinion, is nothing. And what I mean by that is not just not doing your job, not doing your task list, not doing your follow-ups, but what I see people struggle with is I didn't know what to do, so I did nothing. This can cause so many misunderstandings with your agents and clients. It can cause potentially big issues within a transaction of things not getting done. And it's the absolute worst thing you can do. I have made this mistake early on in my career and it is really impactful. So how to avoid this? Always look at the tasks that you need to do and think, what can I do, right? Maybe I can send another follow-up. Maybe I can try to think of a creative solution. Maybe I can just text my agent, let them know an update we're still waiting on this or ask them how they want me to handle it. An example of this, maybe we saw a repair amendment come in. We didn't know if the agent was gonna send it or if we were gonna send it. So maybe we assume, which we all know the saying about that word, that the agent's gonna handle it and they assume that we're gonna handle it. These are things that you can be clear with upfront in your onboarding calls, but also little things you'll learn as each transaction is different as you get used to working with agents as well. What I would do in that situation, I would send the agent a message, say, hey, were you gonna send that over or did you want me to? A simple text like that can clear up so many miscommunications. If there's something you just don't know how to do and you can't figure it out, don't be afraid to ask the agent for help. It's always better to take some type of step and alert your client than to do nothing just because you didn't know what to do. That's my number one mistake I advise you to avoid in your TC business. Follow us for more TC and real estate agent tips.